Hey there beautiful people, I hope that you are doing so very well. I'm here today to update you on a kindness challenge from last month and what I did and what we will be doing this month. If I'm being straight and being real with you, I pretty much failed this month. <sighs> so bad. My month was so much busier than I expected it to be and it just nothing worked out. I didn't get to go to the rare breed at all. Normally I go on Friday nights but I didn't even go once this month and I didn't even get to go to Convoy of Hope and I just feel like such a failure. I do volunteer my church like twice a week so I guess that kind of counts because I'm you know pouring positivity and influence into these kids' lives. So I guess that kind of counts, but really like what I wanted to do, I didn't do any of it. If that encourages you at all because you were just like, man, I just failed it up this month, I feel bad too. And I'm going to try to do so much better and volunteer some next month since I did not do it at all this month. <sighs> Sorry that I don't have any stories for you or any fun things because I just failed it up. I'm so sorry. So this month's challenge is going to be gift giving. I was actually inspired to do this month's challenge by something that happened to me. I wasn't sure what I wanted to do for this month. Even into the first couple days of May, I was like, man, what do I want to do for May? And I figured it out when this wonderful, wonderful person named Lindsay Ray, I will leave her links to her YouTube page and her Twitter down below, sent me a book from my Amazon wishlist registry, which first of all, it's kind of hard to find that because I don't talk about it a lot because I don't want anybody to feel obligated to buy me books ever, or if you don't have money, don't buy me books or anything. So I'm just like, I don't really talk about it, I don't really put it in my description, but I have it on one website on the internet, that's it. So she must have somehow found out about it, maybe I talked about it in the live show or something, and she sent me a book and sent me the sweetest note ever about how I inspired her to do booktube and how I'm always a happy and positive person and I was overcome with happiness and emotion and I just felt so happy that someone thought of me and liked enough what I did to send me something. It was actually this book right here, this beautiful copy of Everybody Sees the Ants by A.S. King. So thank you so much for that, Lindsay. You are a wonderful person. If you, somebody has a birthday this month, sure, that works, but I'm thinking more along the lines of like, random gift giving because you just really want to show someone that you appreciate them so you're going to get them a Starbucks gift card or a book off their Amazon wish list or just something like that or make them a graphic even like something that takes some time or some effort on your part and just give it to someone just because you want to, just because they've influenced and impacted your life positively and you want to give them something back and spread more love into the world. I'm excited to do this. I love gift giving. I mean, as much as this is supposed to be for other people, I personally get so much joy out of gift giving and like spending my money on other people. That sounds really weird, but it's true and I love it. So I'm very excited for this month's challenge and all of my friends might be getting some gifts soon. We'll see. Gotta get through this weekend and the wedding and next weekend in Connecticut first and then gifts will happen. So I hope that you want to participate in this month's challenge. Let me know how you did this month. Hopefully your volunteering made up for my fail month of non-volunteering. I love you all so very much. Thank you so much for being positive and wonderful and lovely people and I will see you next time. Bye. Oh, I'm sure that was a beautiful face. I'm sure that was the most beautiful face there ever was.